body. Um, sorry if I sound a little funny, I just woke up like a half an hour ago and I'm still trying to get used to it. It's a really nice day out here in Portland, although it's raining a little bit, kind of lightly as you can see on the... Oh my god, I'm going to clean that out. <sighs> so anyway, what happened last night was... Uh, was pretty much the first night of the Portland Retro Gaming Expo, which the arcade was pretty much uh, the only thing that's open. At least I got to play a couple of pinball games that I've played before, some I haven't tried yet. That uh, Hobbit pinball machine was kind of nice, I think. You know what bugs me though? I can see why Nintendo pretty much made the NES version of some arcade games a lot easier, because the arcade versions are hard as shit, man. So anyway, I'm just gonna stay out here and explore the city for a while. I'll be back at the expo like around 10, 11 ish. So uh, we'll be able to see what's up next. Check it out, man. That's a real Shaolin Tempo. That's that's the mud awesome, bro. Thanks a lot, Joe. Now I got that word stuck in my head. Hi, birdie. What's up, bird? How's it going, bird? Oh, uh, you don't want to talk, huh? Hell yeah, man. Like this one. It's like, he's like, what, what, bro? He's like, what, bro? You feeling me? He shows his ass as he leaves. Yeah, yeah, screw you too. My God, that's a whole lot of water. And look, there's a steel bridge right there. Huh. That's where I'm going next. Dude, real talk. People keep staring at me and I have just took pictures of people because they think I'm a real life photographer. But no, this is just a this is just a convention pass. They think I'm a photographer. <sighs> Strange but true. That seagull's like, who you looking at, bruh? That's a whole lot of birds over here. That's for sure. <laughs> This is a huge safety measure, so don't die. Whoop! Don't die. Sorry if my hair looks a little wet, but so what? It's still my sexy ass hair. I like this slick look. Well, here we are. Finally. Finally made it here. Now let's start the damn day.
Good morning, everybody. Happy Sunday, and look at this tree, man. Look, this is just, this is not a big tree. This is just small. It's like as tall as me. <laughs> so this is going to be day three of the convention, the final day. This will be my final day in Portland before I leave the next morning. So I'm just going to hang out at the panels, and if I have enough time, I'll probably go to the zoo to check out the gorillas because gorillas are awesome. I, I just want to see the gorillas. Um, maybe maybe something else, but mainly for the gorillas. Oh, well, I'm going to go check out the day and enjoy eating some breakfast, and I just had hot chocolate. Okay, so here's the story. I went to the bank, right? It's a pretty decent walk from the hotel, and I stopped by this uh, coffee shop called uh, Pete's Coffee, I think it's called. It, I'll put it in the video just to make sure what it is so you guys will know. Shout out to them. Uh, well, I just ordered a hot chocolate and an apple turnover, which is pretty dope. And, uh, oh, and the one of the baristas commented on this shirt, the uh, New York Synthesis, New York School of Synthesis. If you guys remember that videotape from the late 80s, I think, they still make those shirts. They're still around, selling shirts to keep paycheck going. I don't know. That's how they earn their living. I think that's how uh, I think that's how Dean Friedman learns a living right now. Well, he's a songwriter, so of course he's always making a living for himself. Some of the guys let you go for a bit, so uh, I'll see you guys over there at the convention soon. Swan Death Kit that Kelsey talked about in one video. And also the Wonder Boy. Hmm, not bad. Alright. Spot.
so the Super Nintendo CD, as it was called here in the magazine thing right here. So the thing really works. It's working order, man. All right. Man, if this thing really existed. I would have gone nuts. Yeah, not crazy. Yeah. So who signed all of these? <laughs> I had forgot. I was up early. I had none of this crap up there. Now I get back up there. Uh, oh, Gerald, yeah, Gerald, I'll take you on. So I'm actually here at the VR room. Just trying out some whatever kind of games there are having right now. So I don't even know what's going on, but I'm going to try it out.